I think that's uh, part of the answer. We need to make sure that there is uh, legal migration and legal migration pathways for people to enter the EU, work uh, in one of our countries, because we need some labor uh, in Europe, uh, knowing uh, our own demography. Uh, so, of course, uh, a lot of people who enter the, uh, the European Union asking for asylum uh, end up uh, being uh, refused because they are economical migrants. Two thirds of all asylum seekers uh, uh, get the negative reply. Um, and I think that one of the answers is making sure that there are legal pathways for people who want to migrate to work, making it possible for them to do it inside the, the EU. Uh, but of course, you need other solutions as well. We need to have um, a pact on migration and asylum uh, at the EU level, making sure that uh, we strengthen the borders, we have a screening at the border, uh, but uh, without labor and without migration coming, uh, well, labor forces coming from outside the EU, uh, Europe will have big problems. So uh, you need migration, you need uh, the right kind of migration, and you need the European philosophy to make it happen. Okay, um, reading the, listening to the question, the first thing that comes to my mind um, is a kind of the, the need for a definition. So um, I would like to, to make a distinction, a, a juxtaposition between migration and asylum seeking processes, um, which, I, which I believe is a, is a very crucial uh, definition to make or distinction to make. In what sense? Um, Although we are talking about migrants and refugees, uh, it has become, so to speak, um, an, a one-way route for someone uh, who wishes to enter the, the European Union or the, the European territory, either to enter as an irregular migrant or as an asylum seeker. That means that uh, the only uh, perspective that um, is allowed is for someone to uh, seek uh, refuge, to become an, as uh, an asylum seeker in order to, um, uh, to get uh, this kind of protection, of international protection. So there are not many options uh, during the last years for people that as we can all understand, do not have, uh, let's say, uh, a refuge background. They do not come from, a, from an area that a, a civil war is going on or this, this kind of uh, situations, but rather uh, wishes to, to avoid poverty, exploitation, economic exploitation, or uh, other uh, critical conditions that are not related to the Geneva Convention and so on. So one major thing is to uh, give access to a different kind of approach to Europe, to the European border borders. Besides the um, uh, besides the current uh, asylum seeking processes, so definitely uh, creating. Um, a safe route, a regular route to, to Europe, avoiding, uh, let's say, high risk uh, op options, um, especially in the Mediterranean, would be um, definitely a, a step forward um, for the migration, uh, in, for migration in general and for people's mobility. 